Bardu, the very first superstar. Awesome. Had to be, did it really? No. Yeah. The air and all that. Of course it was. Yes. I feel bad for the Miz, man. They switch his brands every year. That's one prediction right though. Oh, and there he is from behind attacking Shane. I predicted they would switch over the Miz because obviously the feud, they can then restart it somewhere else. If Miz is still on SmackDown and Shane's his boss, then it's just going to be a bit awkward if Miz gets any title opportunities or anything for Shane to just take him away. So send him to Raw and then this feud can then be over. But right, I'm going to do this all in one video, so we'll move on right now for the next uh, shake-up when I believe that they are going to come out. This one was really easy to predict. This might be difficult. <laughs> I'll try and record straight away. I've got my phone set up, but let's go. Right, so Raw's just come back on. And we're getting a... I believe it's a Fatal 4-Way tag match. And... Or, yeah, so Kurt Hawkins is that rider in the ring along with the Revival as the Black and Ricochet. I'm 90% sure it's going to be the Usos. Usos have got to come out next, surely. Ooh, so, wait. Oh! It's the War Raiders. Wait, what? Are you kidding me? I don't think Hanson and Rowe, the, the War Raiders. Yvonne Eric. Have they changed that now? Or do they change that on NXT? That sounds shit. The fuck is that? They're the NXT champions. How can they change their name? Yeah. The fucking Hanson and Rowe. Oh, whatever, man. Whatever. On to the next one. Michael Cole just said that it also affects 205 Live. Oh, we're getting our boy Cedric. Oh, that's upsetting, though. They won't use him. Cedric Alexander is amazing. We all know that, but... He should have been on SmackDown. Cedric Alexander's on Raw now, I guess. If they use him right, then I'll be happy, but, you know, are they? <laughs> Most likely not. Wish he would have been on SmackDown instead. Never mind. Finn Balor's got a match now. Who's his opponent going to be? Raw debut. Come on then, who is it? No! Oh, for fuck's sake! They don't use him on SmackDown. Why put him on Raw? He's just gonna fall down the card again. Oh, man. This sucks so far. I don't know what you guys think, but I am not a fan of any of these so far. Other than The Miz. They could have at least put C and Elmas back in his name. Not a fan. Not a fan. Someone knew he's got to interrupt him, surely. It's been going on for too long now. It's only been a few minutes, but... Montreal crowd don't like him. Okay, I'm with this. I'm cool with this. Rey Mysterio. I didn't predict this, but if he's on his last run, then surely he's got to be on the big show, even though, you know, I love SmackDown dearly, but Vince considers Raw as the A show. And Rey taking it to Elias. 
Oh, Ray slipped. Recovered it well, though. Ray Mysterio is uh, on Raw now, so that's cool. Well, on to the next pick. Chad Gable and Bobby Roode just issued an open challenge. Usos. Usos. Yes! Yes, man, finally! Jimmy and Jay are on Raw. Day one-ish, I'm so happy. This is honestly, like, my number one. That and AJ Styles, even though a lot of people don't want AJ Styles on Raw. I really want to see Styles on Raw, I don't know why. But yes, the Usos are on Raw. Like I said in my predictions, they've beaten everyone on SmackDown. Send them to Raw, they can beat everyone there as well. Usos are on Monday nights, let's go. Well, Bailey just said in a backstage interview that she's getting another partner. Um, I mean, I don't know why they're shaking up the women. Oh, I'm tired. Who's it going to be then? I thought the women's division was going into one, but apparently not yet. Who's it going to be? Oh! Naomi! I suppose if they move Jimmy and Jay, they, uh, they might as well move Naomi as well. It'd be a lot easier. Cool, Naomi's on Raw now. So it's time for the mystery partner, the main event. Is it going to be Styles? I think it is. Rollins, Reigns, and... Yes! Oh, yes! I'm even wearing the shirt. He's here, man. The phenomenal one. AJ Styles is on Monday Night Raw. That's awesome, man. Styles is on Monday Night Raw. How's the AJ built? Not anymore, man. I'm happy. I'm happy now. AJ Styles. We can finally see AJ Styles versus Seth Rollins, the dream match. I do hope you enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Stay tuned for tomorrow for the SmackDown Superstar Shake-Up reactions. See you in the next video.